Hello guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to use sticky forms with PHP. Now this is my second PHP video so let me know what you think. So what sticky form is, if you're not sure, you're just curious, is let's say I've got a username and password here, just not going to be doing this, this is what I've been working on, but see I've typed in my username, random thing, then password, so let's say I got it wrong, it's not programmed to say that, but I press enter, and that means let's say I got it wrong, but then you don't want to type in the username again because um, it's most likely you got your password wrong. So that's what you use sticky forms. So I'm going to show you how to um, do it. Ready? Got um, a form ready. I'm going to start. Okay, so this is the username. I don't want to do on the password because you don't want the password to stay there. So once you've made your form like this, you go um, and add value, and then. So what you're going to be writing, we won't write it in here because I want to show it to you um, clearer. Okay, so what we write is, in the value is, we start the PHP. Okay, now in there we want to write if and is set and we want to um, fetch that. So, oops, I'm just going to add... Um, um, action equals leave it empty. Okay, if set, and then we're going to do dollar underscore and then post into square brackets, and then we'll get username. Once selected that in the if statement, we're going to go like this um, echo. Then um, just copy this. What which is oops, I didn't copy that whatever's in um, the username text box we'll end it with a semicolon and when I'm just going to put that into one line because I just did it like this um, that'll be clearer to show how it works and then we'll give a space between that okay, that's the code um, let's see then insert that into the value basically if it is set then what we want to do is we want it to um, echo it into it, that it kind of saves it and doesn't just run away. So we're going to try that. We're going to enter and then a password. As you can see, it just stayed there, which is a good sign. So we just type something, and then let's say we got our password wrong, press enter, and it's still there, which will be annoying if you filled out a whole form, and then all the things you just typed in um, just went out. So that's the point of sticky forms. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please like the video. And yeah, bye.